Okay guys, good afternoon. We're going to make our own tiles. Our own Zen tiles. This is a box of wheat bix It's very, very good paper. It's an ordinary standard box of wheat bix So, we're going to make our own. We will save some money. Very good drawing paper. Get down to the bay pen. Now, we want... I've got the original tile here. Why am I going downwards? I'm just going to mark it out. A little bump there, that's all right. So mark it out, and we'll have a Zen Tangle tile. Not exactly straight, is he? Well, why can't I see? That's better, put the lights on. Now, keep going and it's the right size. We'll see how many papers we can get. This was an original one. It's not an original, but it's a cheap version of it. They're $9, I think, on eBay for 120 tiles. I've been cutting them up. Hard stop. Now I can only get through it too. It's okay. Maybe I should have went the other way, but we'll go right. We'll get four. We'll get four. something with it we'll black it out maybe and you just cut it out you want you got a bookmark there or here this will make a good bookmark but if you want to post to one of the tangled people on Facebook, they only want your own homemade cardstock or Zentangle tiles. They want you to work in the traditional way, the correct way. So, why not? Me, it's a bit of a silly rule, but hey, that's me. There's one. Not ones. This one's a bit beaten up. That's all right. There's four out of a wheat bix box. It's recycling at its best, guys. I know one lady uses pizza boxes. Leads off a pizza box. There's four. And we'll go the other way, see if we can get an extra one out the other way. 
looking over there, oh we've got an edge here, now I'll take that edge off. Right, we'll go the opposite, this long ways. I might be able to get six. Let's see. We shall see if we can get any more going this way. Oh, marker, paper. No, we can still only get four. So out of that weak big box, we have gotten eight tiles. And the same with your uh, Sultana brand. Boxes are very good. Just Right's another good cardboard to keep. They're very nice soft paper. Now where do we go here? I don't think I can get a third one in. No. No, it's only four. No, eight pieces. Uh, it's too hot in the shed. I gave a paint here a spray coat of varnish. Varnish, it looks quite nice from the other day. And that's done. Yeah, this is my third already. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have a very busy... straight I must miss that line they are the right size and everything Most of the cardboard you should be able to draw on. Can't see why you can't. So that's eight pieces out of there. That would have gone into landfill. They still go into landfill. <laughs> they still happen to go into landfill one day. <laughs> Around the corners of called having fun time and that one's a little bit bigger 
to the, oh, that's all right. The Earth's bright size. There you go, eight pieces of cardstock to play with. There we go, that's what I cut up last night. That's, um, that one I don't like. That's cardstock. I don't mind the rough edges. That's all right. All, all the right size. Four inches by four inches they should be. It should be the right size because that's the original tile. Okay, go on. Now we're going to do a doodle. We are going to doodle. And I think today's doodle is Mooka. I will come back in a minute. I'll get rid of all this bit. I'll go into here. I don't want... I'll do a practice on running on that one. I'll just trim it up. Hang on. We'll just trim that up. I know it won't be the right size for the group, but hey, I'll post it to my own. My own little Facebook page. Watching pouring your heart out. Now I've got a coffee cup sitting here. I'll make that a little bit shorter. Get rid of that tree. That's better. Yeah. Now, see how good it goes. Okay, back in a minute. 